everyone, it's me, Michelle again, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. In today's video, I'm coming back with another grocery haul. This week, I had about $300 I could spend, and I was looking to stock up on some things for my deep freeze, and then just get what we needed throughout the week. So if you're interested in seeing what I got and how much I spent, then just keep on watching. Starting off, these Anytizers boneless wings and the chicken tenders from Tyson, they were on sale this week, the big family size bags. They were on sale down from $10 to $4.99 a piece, so I went ahead and I got all five of those. You could use the coupon five times, and these are just going to go into my deep freezer. These aren't something I usually buy, but at that price, I mean, they're good to have on hand. I'll just throw them in. Then for what we actually needed, this one was turkey sausage. I got the patties, and then I got the links. They're about $7 a piece. Then my husband wanted something easy for his breakfast in the morning because he eats at work, so I got him some of those, the Tennessee Pride, and these were also, I just needed some frozen vegetables, the pepper blend, and then I got some Mexican style vegetables and the Italian style vegetables just to have as side dishes. Then for these turkey burgers, they're a best choice customer because I buy them quite often. I get them for about $6 a box, and then the Owen sausage was on sale, $2.99 a piece, and you could use it five times, so I went ahead and I got those, and I'll add that to my freezer stockpile. Then, for the next thing, I got the beef. This is for dinner today. I paid $10.31. It wasn't on sale. It was just something we felt like eating. I was making rice and gravy. Then, these were $1.99 a box, and you could use it five times, so I went ahead and I got a bunch of Kool-Aid Jammer right now, back to school items, like lunchbox items are on sale, so I was able to get those along with the chocolate chip waffles and the cinnamon waffles. I think they were 40 cents off per box. Cottage cheese, just felt like it. The butter spray, same thing. I haven't bought it in a while, but I need to go back to just like swapping stuff out. I got two of those every week, or whenever I do my grocery shopping, I get two almond milks and then I got some liquid egg whites for myself. And then moving on to the coffee creamer, I got a pumpkin spice this is the only one I will buy for the whole year I like it but not that much and then I got two of the peppermint mochas because we really like that one and then I also got a sugar-free cinnamon roll which is pretty good I also picked up some sugar-free syrup this is for the pancakes waffles etc and then I got some bananas which are still pretty green but that's okay then I also got yogurts for the kids, the yogurt tubes, that's the ones they prefer. String cheese for snacks and lunches, and then these cheeses were on sale. They're usually about $2.50 a piece, but they were on sale this week for $1.99. Still had cheese, shredded cheese left from the last time, so these are all going to go into my deep freezer. And then I got some cheese slices. I got Gouda, extra sharp cheddar aged sharp white cheddar which is extremely good if you've ever tried the Kroger brand one and then Colby Jack and those are for sandwiches and then I've been feeling like a salad so I got these Bolt Out Farm dressings they're the yogurt dressings they were two for six dollars I got the Caesar and then the ranch I got some keto bagels the bagel thins and I got two of those then I also got some gravy mixes i think i'm going to be making some biscuits and gravy for breakfast one of these days this week and then candy corn it's that time of year my family likes it so i get some and put it in candy dishes for them these spaghettios were on sale this week if you bought more than five they were 99 cents for a can and my son loves spaghettios or canned pasta so i got a bunch of those and paid the 99 cents then i got white pepper italian seasoning because i was out of it then I also got the black pepper, and I think there was a sale for these. I can't remember exactly, but I think it was like buy one, get one free, or buy two, get one free. That's why I got three of them, but either way, I know I didn't pay full price for all of those. Then the jumbo biscuits, these are just good to have on hand. I feel like you can do a lot of things with canned biscuit dough. Kroger, or not Kroger, salad. I got bagged salad, Kroger brand, and then I got some onions just because i was out of them and i needed some more these little oranges were on sale again for 2.99 for a bag and i got two of those and then i got the bag of gala apples 
some potatoes and then the bread was also 99 cents a loaf which was pretty good deal when i do my grocery shopping i try to stop about 20 dollars before a goal this time it was 307 was afterwards after taxes and everything came out but after they took my coupons and everything else out of it my total was actually 250 dollars for a savings of 74 dollars and 82 cents and that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And if these are the kinds of videos you want to see again, just let me know in the comments and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.